Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Hunter. My name is Matthew. And together we are Hunter and Matthew, obviously. So today we thought we would just talk about being in an interrelate. Can you say the word? I can't say it. Interracial relationship. That's Inter what we're gonna be talking about. Being in, in an interracial inter relationship. Interracial relationship. You <laughs> can never say that word. And you would think I've been saying it for seven and a half years now. I would have some grasp on how to say that word, but I simply cannot. Inter racial interracial interracial relationship. That's what we're talking about today. So if you like what you see today, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on bell notifications, all the above. And we'll do more things like this if you like it. This video actually is brought to you by this lovely comment right here. Oh, you're holding it. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. I was like, I'm I don't gonna, know what you're trying gonna, to hold. It's gonna go right there, like, you know? And this should go right here. And then if you make me mad, it'll go right here. It should fall in my hand. Be like, whoa, editing. <laughs> we're not there yet. We're not there I don't yet. Know. I don't know. <laughs> you're not there yet. You, he edits the videos, really. I, I don't know how to do all that. I'm still. I'm going to YouTube University on how to use Final Cut Pro. <laughs> so, a little backstory. Rude. Very rude. I'm pouring my heart out right now and you decided to fly? Mm mm. Little backstory about Matthew and me. We've been together for seven and a half years. Next month will be seven and a half years. And married for a little over a year and a half. Just a little. Mm mm. It'll also be a year and a half next month. I thought we were already at a, month, a year and a half. No. Because we, we started dating and got married in February, so the timelines line up. Wait, 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 no. It is in August. I'm wrong. Oh. That's on film. Oh, well, technically, hold up. <laughs> Hold up. Today is August 19th. Our year and a half is not for six more days. Wait, 10 more days. And uh, so I'm still correct. I still did somewhat of math correct. Anyways, um, so we've been together for seven and a half years. Married for almost a year and a half. To us, it's just always been, this is Matthew and me, you know? Yeah. It, that's the question I get asked a lot. It's like, what's it like being married? I don't know. I've been with you for seven and a half years. Like, it's not really much different when <laughs> you still live together. We've lived together since college, really. Mm -hmm. And so it's not much different. So we, we started dating in 2014, met in high school. I, we went to a magnet school with a performing arts sector. So we went to pretty much performing arts high school. So pretty much every day was like high school musical, like what you would imagine that. I would think not high school musical. Victorious is more Yeah, it's more like, speed. you know, Victorious on Nickelodeon. Like, I think we all sing that, that. <laughs> Think we all sing. I think we all sing. Actually, during the we all sing. It's true. Yeah. That is more of what our school was like. And so, if you can imagine, it was pretty much a predominantly white part of the magnet school. So for me, it's not like I had all these choices of dark, delicious black men to choose from. <laughs> so it's not, hmm, let me not get off track. I don't know where that came from. So I'm gonna keep going. You take over then. I don't know what you were talking about. You started talking about dark, delicious, beautiful black men. And I it's said, like, so where? It's like, it's like, you know, Pearl and SpongeBob. She's like tall, dark, and handsome. You know, she kept and saying that. that like, me, 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 I, I haven't really felt that much instances where 
race has come up in our relationship, I think one of the biggest things is maybe pop culture. You know, black people are raised differently than white people. Most of the time, not all the time. Not all the time. And but... so just like references that we know might just vary. Well, you said it really nice once is that you know all your references, but I need to know my references and your references to get by. Yeah, so me, I said that. So growing up, just to like meet the mark, I had to know all the white references, but on top of that, to still be relevant in my own community, I'd have to also know all the black references. So being with Matthew, I was like, I cannot carry both of these loads. Let's learn together. So, Matthew knows. He knows, he knows. <laughs> I dyed my hair today and I can't be stopped. Matthew's invited to the cookout. Stiff wear. <laughs> Stiff wear, that's a black reference. <laughs> Stiff wear, black reference. Exactly. So like, I'm invited to the cookout because we're married. It, it's like, you can still not be invited. Okay, that is true. I am invited though, I think. I guess I just kinda of don't care. I just kinda of bring you anyways. I'm just like, here he is. Hey. <laughs> am I the white cousin? I have multiple white I have a couple white cousins. I know. Yes. I just know there's always like the white one. That everyone's like mm. Like the problematic white one? I'm not problematic. I, I have think, one of those too. At the end of the day, I don't think I'm that white cousin. No, you're not that white cousin. You're just Matthew. But like, I think one of the most fun things I've realized while being with a white person is seeing Matthew's like personality. I make references and jokes and I cut up just as well as like you do and your parents do. Yeah, cause, I keep up. Yeah, because when Matthew and I first started dating, I realized, you know, black people like to roast each other back and forth real quick and that's just what we do and hopefully you don't get offended by it and so Matthew just to stand his own I guess you would have to not really stand my own it's just to not I, I am now a driver on the track let's ride sure instead of being in the pit stop sure okay I'm following your reference yeah I'm not the fastest car. No one will ever be the fastest car, but I am on the race. You are in the race. That is good. Yay! I used a NASCAR reference. That's disgusting. Your dad would be so proud. I don't even think he likes NASCAR that much. I definitely watched him watch NASCAR for like well, two hours. Yeah. Oh, no. My family used to have NASCAR parties. Not parties, but like we'd have a lot of people over and we watch NASCAR. See, that doesn't. In my country, that doesn't happen in my family. Maybe that's a struggle I've had to go through is that's something he's had to go through having to like you know be able to roast each other back and forth me personally you know marrying into a white family I guess you can say I've personally never really felt unwelcome like Matthew's family's not racist good I'm glad I'm glad you feel welcomed in him I'm not blinking. <laughs> I'm not blinking. I'm not gagging. It's been really smooth sailing for us personally, but I know that's not the case for everybody. It's not, a ca it's not the case for a lot of people. I think we are just very, very lucky to have families that are pretty cool. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I will say we are very fortunate and very lucky in that respect. Peaceful man. I will say when it comes to um, Oh, here's a big one. When it comes oh, no. to, the, Matthew and I argue about this all the time. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. It doesn't always need a meat. Yes, it does. It doesn't. Yes, it does. It Matthew. doesn't. I will refuse to ever have spaghetti unless there's some kind of ground beef or ground turkey in it. It doesn't. Spaghetti with sauce. No. 
No. And so whenever we make spaghetti, I make my little meat sauce on the side, and Matthew has this little bald no, ass. No, no, no. We're not going to get it twisted. We still eat the meat-based sauces because that's what you like. We don't cook the sauce separately from the chicken or the turkey, whatever we use. We put them together, and then we store it away in the fridge, and then no one eats it. <laughs> that's that's not relevant to the argument. The point is, cooking sauce, that's where a lot of this... Um, yeah, I use seasoning and you don't. That's not true. I use spice. I you use just spice. like spicy food, which is kind of stereotypically black. And I don't like spicy foods, but you do. Your parents and I enjoy spicy food together. Yeah, I'm like, when, so I'm an only child, and so when it's just me, Matthew, my parents together, they're all like... <laughs> It burns so good. And I'm Andy's over here. chicken in Kentucky. Yeah, and I'm over here with my like mild chicken wings. I'm like, it burns. <laughs> they may come that strong about it. Yeah, so I think when it comes to food, we differ. Like, tell the story of what my cousin said to you on Thanksgiving. Tell that story of what my cousin said to you. On Thanksgiving, it was, it was a Christmas. It was Christmas. It was I don't, because you usually go to someone else's house for Thanksgiving, and I usually stayed at mine. Okay, well, tell your story. So it was Christmas. Embarrassed. So it's Christmas, and we're all eating. And this was Christmas a couple years ago. I go and fix myself a little plate, and I go, "Ooh, turkey! I love turkey. I really do like turkey." Like, cut me up some slices, and I'm eating. And then his cousin looks at me dead in the face, quietly, and says, Why are you eating the dry meat? And everyone said, <laughs> <laughs> Because, you know- There was so much of it. I was like, wow, I guess no one's eating the turkey. Like for turkey to be the staple of Thanksgiving dinner, that means- It's Christmas. Either way, for it to be the staple of whatever dinner, it'd be dry as hell. And I enjoy turkey. And turkey is relatively dry. You can't be me. It could not be me. I'd skip right past this. I mean, I like the flavor, sure, but the moisture, not enough. Yes, you can like douse it in gravy or whatever, which most people do, but Matthew was just eating it plain up, like straight up. I don't like gravy. Yeah, so that's something that's happened. Whereas I go to Matthew's family's house for Christmas and I actually kind of enjoy this tradition. This is kind of fun. They, instead of like having a big Christmas spread, they order Papa John's pizza and Krispy Kreme donuts. It's because it's simple. If everyone enjoys it, everyone will eat it and everyone will want to take it home. It's delicious. It's so good. Um, been doing it for, I've been going years. to their house for Christmas since Matthew and I were less than a year into our, our relationship. This is like the family Christmas party that's not always on Christmas, but. Love this tradition. It's so white, but I still love it. I love it. It's such... You consider that white? It's, yes. It's, it's, I will say it's non-traditional. It's very non-traditional. I guess it's not really any race. However... It's something white people would do. Yeah, it's a little... It's a little, it's a little white. A little... It's, I wouldn't say it's sus. <laughs> it's white. But I love it. It's delicious. I live for it. I look forward to it year after year. A few moments later... Racism. Did you know <laughs> that a raisin in the sun is not about raisins or, or sun, sun, but about racism, racism and, and then, then some. some? Trademark. Anyways. Trademark. Me. I made that up. Uh, I know you did, but I'm trademarking marking it right now. So if it ends up on playbill.com, they start to hear. That was, the, I think, one of the funniest things I've ever said. It was pretty good. Thank you. My hair, is, it, my hair is usually has some wave to it. It's really straight because it's just been dyed. So I just feel like Lord Farquaad. Um, you can't tell me. 
It's the Bob for me. I don't know about you. I've never really experienced like anyone being like, oh, you're with someone who's black. I've never, okay, once. It's a funny story. I'm not gonna say any names or anything like that, but I was working once and I, everyone knows I have a husband. Um, and one day I was like, my husband's gonna come into work and like just bop around. And he came in, Hunter came in, and I was like introducing him to like my friends at work, all this and that. And then Hunter leaves, cause he didn't want to get anything. Um, and <laughs> one of my coworkers, um, they're black. They were like, you know, Matthew, I just didn't see that for you. <laughs> I didn't see that. She was like, you're very beautiful together. I just don't see this for you. <laughs> or didn't see that for you. She, it's not that she said, I don't see this for you. It was like a, I did not expect this turn of events. <laughs> it was the only time anyone's ever been like, oh, you're with someone black. It's the only time it's ever happened. And that was in New York. Yeah. It is what it is. It is what it is. My favorite thing to do though, is I'll, I'll just kind of be singing in my little, my own little world and I'll, be singing some like black gospel song or black artist or whatever. And I'm like, you know the song? And then about six times out of 10, sometimes he does know it, but six times out of 10, he'll say no. No. And then I'll have to play it for him. Do you know the song? Never would have made it. No, but don't Never get copyrighted. Do you want to see a video of Hunter playing songs and me saying, I don't know this. I know this. I don't know this. I don't know this. I don't know this. I don't know this. No. Sounds like a really short video. <laughs> you, that's a classic gospel song. Well, classic. Classic stuff right now. Oh. <laughs> then again, um, there's some white things that I. <laughs> what white things do you not know? PBS. He don't know PBS. He don't know PBS. I don't know PBS. I ain't watch PBS. And the thing is, I don't even think PBS is white. No, it's not. I just don't know PBS. I just don't know it. Like Clifford, the Big Red Dog, Arthur. Cyber Chase, Fetch with Ruff Ruffman. Huh? What? Fetch with Ruff Ruffman. I ain't never heard of that. Zoom. Come on, Zoom. Come on, Zoom. So I wanted to be a Zoom kid so badly. I wanted to be a Zoom kid so badly. That's right. That's right. We will have correct grammar. What a weird video. Yeah, but the, the, um, when we first started dating, I think because we went to a performing arts high school and there was 15 of us in our major, and we pretty much did all of our classes together. Mm -hmm. They're mostly concerned with us. If we broke up with each other, the How new... would that change the dynamic of yeah. the class? Now, because there's, there's only 15 of us and two out of the 15 are now dating. But we didn't break up. We so. did. <laughs> I will say there was one person, it was so funny. She she knows who she, she is. She knows who she is. She is our biggest one of our biggest fans now, I will say. <laughs> I said, hey, what if Hunter and I started dating? She goes, no. We were in math. She goes, no. When were we already dating for like a week by then? We, we yeah. were dating in secret. Yeah. Cause we didn't want our class to know, because we didn't know how everyone would talk. And so we, we just told everyone after that. It's... She was not happy for like two months and then all of a sudden. It was wonderful. Like, some, <laughs> we started dating in February, then some random day in like April, she was like, I'm the biggest fan! I support this now. I think because we had gone <laughs> two months without breaking up with each other. Yeah. And she was like, oh, maybe it'll work. Here we are! <laughs> <laughs> it's time then because, fact about us, our apartment does not have AC, and so all of our fans are off right now. There's no static in the background, and it's hot as in this apartment right now, so we must end this because I'm about to have a heat. Wrap it up. So, um, thank you for watching our chaotic video. 
Editing this is gonna be fun because I don't even know if there's any usable content in this. We'll find out. But we will find out before you find out because obviously we had to find out to post this shit. Ooh. I almost said it, I almost caught a case. No, you You got three out of the four letters out. <laughs> she. <laughs> she. Oh, what do those, the TikTok kids say? She. she. What does that mean? If like, you know what that means, please let an old person know. We're only yeah. 24, but I still don't understand what that means. <laughs> my, my days are counted for 24. Well, technically everyone's days are counting for 24. My days are still counting for 24, and so my days are longer. I still got a whole seven months. Days are numbered. That's the phrase. And I said counted. It's okay because we're going to rent cars, and we're going to get dogs, and we're, what else can we do at 25? So 25, we're going to get a car and a dog. Boom. And it's going to be a Tessie. We're gonna rent a Tessie, drive around for no reason, and return it. Why not? Because we're 25. I'm 25. That's what's up. I'm 25. That's what's up. <laughs> Two months from now, our next video is gonna be, not our next video, but one of our videos is gonna be, we rent a Tesla for a day, drive around in my seat. You will be driving around in our seat. I'm place. not 25, you can drive it. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I really don't know if we answered your question, but it was a great question. And thank you for all the other suggestions you posted in your comment. Because Keep them coming. We love doing stuff like this when it, we can just like sit here and talk. Yeah, about if that's what you all like, let us know. Put a like on the video if you like videos like this. Um, write in the comments if you wanna see other videos. And if you wanna keep seeing more of us, subscribe. It's the best mm -hmm. way to know when our videos are coming out, especially if the bell notification. Ding, 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 ding. Bye. Bye. Look, we got matching bands, everyone. It's very of us, right? What is the Nike Pride band? Um, oh, I'm not. We're done. Wait. We're done. Wait. We're done. I'm Wait. turning it off. No, no, I'm wearing it. I'm married, happily married. Hi. I love my life. I, oh. <laughs> I love my life. I oh. <laughs> oh my God, you caught my ring. That's crazy. He just threw this at my hoo-hoo. I didn't throw it at your hoo-hoo. It landed there. Threw it at my hoo-hoo.